Yvonne did something that made Junior stand so much that I couldn't get off. When they said cut, I couldn't stand up because I was standing up. Hello, everybody. How are you doing? Hope everybody's doing beautiful today. Hope you guys are doing great. Thank you so much for joining me. In my, um, I almost call it a podcast, but I just like calling it a show. It's a show. It's a YouTube show. Would you get me? And every time you guys show up for my show, it shows that your face they show. Do you understand? I appreciate everybody. Okay. So today I want to talk about, because most people that know me on YouTube know me from acting movies, right? So today I want to talk, <laughs> I want to talk about some of the interesting moments I found myself in while acting. These are not my highlights. These are not my, in terms of like my favorite moments. These are just moments that happen that I believe we are interested in. It shocked me when it happened. You understand? So, <laughs> oh my God. There's, a, there's one actress. Um, I think she produced the movie at the time. This was like, the first year I started acting, she produced the movie and she was acting in it. Uh, first or second year, this was either 2017 or 2018. She produced the movie and she was the lead actress. And she was she was she waited for me from like a couple of weeks so we could shoot that movie together. So the kissing scene. I'm a bit traumatized thinking about it. I don't even lie. I'm still, I'm still a bit traumatized. The kissing scene. This woman planned this thing. I not even tell me she's no planner. Freaky woman. You know, if you are getting ready to kiss a, a lady, like or a lady, if you're getting ready, anybody that's getting ready to kiss, right? It's like if somebody's coming to your house, you go fix up your house now, like. Hey, Percy, they come. Do you understand? But this, imagine, <laughs> at least swallow your spit now. I have to say it, because that is the way. It wasn't sexy. Girl, it wasn't sexy. I know you are thinking it's like a turn on, but I don't know you. I just met you. You're putting spit inside my mouth. That was when I learned the acting kissing. Don't open mouths. Just keep your mouth closed and then use your, see, this is your mouth, this is your bottom lip, this is your top lip. This is your bottom lip, this is your top lip, right? Don't open it. This is a rookie's move. This was me then. She opened her mouth, she come use tongue, come transfer transferables, which wasn't supposed to be transferable. Do you understand? So now I, back now, recently, you know, with experience, I don't do this, don't ever do this. Keep it like this. And then, if this one do like this, she feel it, duck your mouth, chop your mouth, and it's cool. Uh, people with the watch will be like, ah, she's eager, whatever, all join. But now, nah, if she get experience too, and she no be, you know, like that other one, we now go just use this one, touch this one small, touch this one small. Bam, you don't finish. You go back to her boyfriend that's okay with her doing that. I go back to my girlfriend that's okay with me doing that. So I don't have a girlfriend, because my girlfriend probably won't be okay with me doing that. But still, you know, open mouth, open everything. Do you understand? Some people, some sex scenes are so boring. Not mine, no. My sex scenes are awesome. Like, awesome. <laughs> but there are some movies that you watch. I rarely watch movies, but there are some movies that you catch and then you see the sex scene and you can tell that they didn't have a conversation or they don't have a... Sometimes you don't have to have a conversation with the girl when you're about to do a sex scene. Sometimes you put her in sync, but you have to have that chemistry it's always good to have the conversation, though, just to be safe. Like, just, hey, okay, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that, I hope you're okay with this and that. You know, because most of movies is actors that direct it to. Act, directors do the big general work, but it's like football. When you're inside the field, it's not your manager that's telling you, it's your captain, it's your goalkeeper, it's your defender, it's your midfielder, it's your striker. Do you understand? So that's like movies as well. Once they say action, director cannot come and be, do you understand? It's now you too. So you have to tell her, okay, I'm going to grab your thigh and then I'm going to slide it up to your knee, the back of your knee, and pull you towards me. I hope you're okay with that. She'll be like, okay. If you're, unless you're on some freaky, weird thing. If that girl told me she was going to transfer two buckets of saliva into my mouth, I for I for say no now. Nah. Do you understand? So, you know, but some sex scenes that these people do, you can tell that they don't have that in synchronization, I be. 
We say call that thing. I go school. Look. I don't forget. But in sync, what I go? <laughs> you see, I do my hand like this. If you don't understand, now, now your own problem with that. <laughs> so if you are not in sync, it shows on camera. Chemistry shows. I've had some really, 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 really good sex scenes. The very first sex scene I did, I still remember. It's a movie called Unfinished Business with Yvonne Jagede, directed by Remy Binola, produced by Rock. I remember every detail. That was the very first Nollywood movie I acted in. It was June or July 2017 in Lagos here. Yeah. At that point, I, I, I've been having intimate relations with women all my life. Do you get me? So I, that part I'm comfortable with. And I found the actress I was acting with attractive, Yvonne, check it out. But Yvonne, I shall expose you today, my beautiful colleague. Yvonne, should I expose you today, my beautiful colleague? <laughs> Yo, Yvonne did something that made Junior stand so much that I couldn't get off. When they said cut, I couldn't stand up because I was standing up. If you understand, you understand. She now giggled and just stood up. That's the thing with women. They all know the two show evidence. Our own, everything is too extra. If we are in the mood, our trousers are good. If we don't boss, ice cream will come out. They all know everything low key, D low. You know, if you know, she feel lie to you. You feel no, no. She feel there. Ah. If you feel no, be, ah. just understand. Uh -huh. But she do that thing, and her own, oh, no, nobody go, hey, nothing. She just walk out, go her room, go change. Me, I, I, I lay down there. But see, we want change for the next thing. You know, this, and not only would say, then they know. Say, hey, uh, bro, sir, may, may I change? No, I want, I want change. Uh, but she said, bro, I know if you stand up now. I don't go lie to you. I don't go lie to you. I had to tell the truth. Because they know. How can I, but she, she, she that, that scene, we were lying in bed talking. We weren't even banging in the scene. But she was doing something. Well, I was supposed to be in a certain mood. So she helped me. What she did helped me. <sighs> Yvonne, what's up, man? When last, when last, we haven't even seen in a while, man. How you doing, man? You good? I'll call you after this. <laughs> it wasn't like the bucket of spit woman. This one was classy. This was, this was welcome. Okay? Now... I shall tell one more story from my Nollywood history. I had a fight scene with a guy, one actor, and I don't like that guy because <laughs> of that fight. <laughs> but I made a joke. So I think he didn't like me first before I didn't like him. But you know, if somebody doesn't like you first, they can do something to you. And then you not liking them will come late. So, you know, now who punched first? You know that kind of thing. Because when you want punch, everybody will hold you. <laughs> so shout out to that idiot, child. But we made a good movie. Um, see, uh, this guy, will be a palm <laughs> We do fight scene. This guy need me for this place, for, for ribs. I carried that scene for months. Uh, because waiting. Uh, because they get room away, uh, the guy... The uh, see, yeah, see what's in, see what's happen, see what's happen. Might talk with you. I don't talk the person's name, so I feel talk with you. Happen, you get me? This guy come the one guy, okay. <laughs> I go tell the story with that. <laughs> I know be snitch, I know be gonna because in, in certain circles, if you're a gunner, you're a gunner because they have real gunners. What I go, but that's not what I'm talking about, right? I'm not going to call anybody's name and I'm not confirming or denying anything, but. There was a place we were shooting, and the person that was managing the place was flirting with the guy. And the person that's managing the place is a guy. Um, and hey, me, I'm for anybody who do anything where you want to do. As far as you do, I'm on your side. It's all good. For real. Because I schooled in Nottingham, LA. So I've seen a lot of different kinds of people. So love to everybody. But they, in that but is that, don't be rubbing it in everybody's face. Like people are coming back from school. You come there. Do you get me? It's all good though, whatever. But. If you put it there, I can now joke on it. Because if you people know, come outside, they do it in front of everybody. I know go joke on them. But you come there, ah, oh, you're so handsome. Ah, oh my God, I can't, you know, this one, this one. Certain things, way, you know. So I, I told the actor in front of everybody, all the crew, I think this is why he need me. I actually know this is why he need me in the fight scene. I said, uh, I almost called his name, thank God. If I would, I would have to delete it. <laughs> 
Well, um, I can call his name and they'll bleep his, but I won't. Um, so I, I say, I called his name. I say, hey, bro. Um, not bro, cause uh, hey, guy. <laughs> you know they sell pampas down the road. <laughs> I swear. That was that was not good. I said they sell pampas down the road. Everybody went, whoa. But I did that. And I thought it was all jokes. <laughs> Until he got to the fight scene and Kama, Kama came and hit me in the ribs in the form of his knee. Oh boy, that's in pain me. Ha! That's in pain me. He paid me past wasting it. I tell him, pay him, probably. Because, man, ah, right now it's 1 0. I'm waiting to get him back. <laughs> I'm going to score hat trick next time we encounter. <laughs> it's on site. You know who you are. Need me, man. Proper knee. Even director come post this and say, ah, when I get beef. <laughs> that director is a funny director, too. The way he just talk about <laughs> That guy is funny. He didn't post it though. He, went, he waited for us to finish the scene as a proper director. And then he doesn't say, ah, well, I get beef. Ah, <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. I still think about that day sometimes, man. I get angry. <laughs> but when I mean talk and fence, I'm my, I'm my mouth to do them. But see, if they flex with a man in front of everybody now and I joke on them, it's allowed. It's allowed. It's allowed. It's allowed. So I, in a one zero, I go still get him back. Patrick, Haaland next time. Rashford, forget Haaland. Rashford, next time I see you. Speaking of Rashford, man, you back. Season back. We winning. You know what it is. Ten hag. I don't know when we're going to drop this episode, so hopefully we are doing well right now. Hopefully we are number one. You know what it is. Rasmus Hoyland. Mason Mounts wearing the number seven. Big seven. Shout out Burner Boy too. You know, we got our own big seven. Well, I, I started big seven years. Let's not lie. That number is big. Oh. Beckham, don't wear that number. George Best, don't wear that number. Not to talk of arguably the greatest footballer ever to kick a ball. C. Ronaldo, don't wear that number. So, Messi Mounts, are you going to be a Valencia or are you going to be a Beckham? Because you can't probably can't be Ronaldo. It's possible. Who knows? I don't know. I don't think it's possible. Anything is possible. You know? But hey, guys. That was me talking about the Nollywood days and the Nollywood ways in terms of how to kiss without having 17 buckets inside your mat of speed. What I go? So if you're going into the game, if you're going into the industry, go in with that knowledge of how to kiss. And if you're a smoker, before you kiss, chew gum. Um, I used to carry a toothbrush and toothpaste to set one time like that. And Kunle Remy saw me and started laughing. <laughs> he saw me on set with it. <laughs> Kunle started laughing. You know, Kunle is a funny guy, man. He saw me with toothpaste and toothbrush. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I'm sure he remembers that thing, man. He started laughing. But yeah, you have to do what you have to do, man. You, don't, you never want the lady to go talking trash. Even though you can't be perfect, you know. Maybe there's one day I wasn't perfect. But I give my best every single day. Guys, I love you so much. So very much. I'm going to watch some videos and then I'm going to freestyle. And it's going to be adieu for today. Yo! Okay, today I'm going to play some videos of my brother Tay. It's a lie, it's not my brother, it's me. <laughs> I was joking with them that it's it's not it's not me. That's my brother. Cause this was like two, three years ago when I was slimmer. Play the first one, man. This is motivation. Um, for me. Too sexy for the store. Too sexy for the seat. Too sexy for this feeling watch. myself. Too sexy for this um. Too sexy for this phone. So cool. Like an AC, bro. <laughs> I was in Canada. Love you guys. I was in Canada when I recorded that voice notes. But hey, the thing is that these videos are to inspire me to get back in shape. You can ask them. You can't see them. But the people here saw me doing push-ups on sets because I am upset that my stomach looks like sugar daddy and I don't get sugar daddy money. I can't have sugar daddy tummy without sugar daddy mommy money. Do you understand? So I need money. But now I don't have money. I don't have to have sugar daddy tummy. Do you understand? So these videos here 
I have to inspire me with my fat face now. See my cheeks. My cheek. I'm still kind of handsome. I still find it small, Sean. I mean, you agree? Yeah. I know you agree. You know what it is. DM me, DM me. Comments. Comment your number. Comment your number in the, in the comments. I'll call you. You in particular. No, 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 you, no, you, 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 you. Yeah, I'll call you. All right, let's see the next one. Oh, I see you. See how fresh. I look fresh, man. Today I said I'm just going to look at my old videos. Now, this stomach will be poking out like Pokemon. Oh, but shout out for Nani Couture. It's a store in Lekki One. Check it out. Um, yeah, she's a she's a real one. She's a real one. She's a real one. Funani. Uh, check it out. Funani Couture on uh, Lekki One. She's cool. But like I made her clothes look good too, you know. The clothes look good. I mean I look good. I come in a combination of good, good. You come turn out great. You understand? Be like if you have good jeans, you knock woman, we get good jeans. Ooh yeah. When I go born Einstein. What I go? When I go born and go take. <laughs> you get what I'm trying to say? Good jeans and good jeans. Let's get it. Let's see the next one. I bet we just that for We don't get right. Ah, see me feeling myself. Feeling mass. Looking away. Looking like, ah, touching my stomach. Flat stomach. Clapping for myself. Yes, I have flat stomach. Yes, I uh have. -huh. You don't need dance. You don't need do swag. Overdoing. I, I know say you get flat stomach, idiot. No, they touch your stomach every time. They remind me, say my own dumb big. Bam, we get there. Sure, two years ago, I was a dickhead. <laughs> Why are you feeling yourself? What are you feeling like? Who are you calling? There's nobody there. Yeah, it's a lie. There was nobody there. I was just doing this thing. See, I'm, I'm jealous of myself. <laughs> oh, my God. But my stomach is not too bad. Is it bad? You people should check out my IG, Ray Emory, uh, to see my stomach and see, tell me if it's bad. Okay? You can also check out my Twitter or X. I don't know what they call it. I guess Twitter is the X name. Twitter is now the X. It's now X. You understand? That's a mind trip. It's been Twitter since forever. Now it's X. Shout out Elon Musk. Don't they pay niggas? Don't they pay Nigerians? Mark Zuckerberg, way Facebook, don't they since? Still don't they pay Nigeria? We you guys do why 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 you get our own? Eh? What kind of rubbish is that, Mark Zuckerberg? I used to support you. I even did thread when nobody did. Nobody did thread though. I did. See the post on top thread. You know, the, you know what monetizes uh, Facebook where you come before everything? Which guy in be that now? Mark, no, they fix up, oh. Fix up. I'm serious. I've been, I was on Facebook since. Then I entered Instagram. I don't know. I did WhatsApp. Hey, Mark. Now, Mark, you f*** up. They go bleep the, the F word. But, Mark, no, they do like that. You know, must just buy this thing like how many months ago? You don't monetize. They pay Daniel Rega. Eh? Why we, why you, Facebook, we go, they do us, we go, they use personal accounts for UK. They go, they do us anyhow. Which kind of rubbish be that? Yo, Mark, you're racist, though. I'm not, no, 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 I take that back. Mark Zuckerberg is not racist, but the fact that he hasn't monetized most of Africa is a bit racially insensitive. You see, I, I go to school, so I, I say, we talk him without talking. <laughs> like American people, when you argue with them, I go talk him, but I know talk him. If we go cuss now, I say, yo, it's racially insensitive. Do you understand? Let's see the last video, man. Oh, I'm looking at the mirror, I'm looking at myself. See, hey, I'm such a douchebag back then. See how I'm feeling myself so much. Eh? Is it because you're handsome? Are you the only handsome person in the world? See, I'm just looking at myself. See, I'm not even doing anything. I'm just looking at myself. See, see. You play this one again, sure. Play, see, see the stupidity I displayed here when I was fine. <laughs> I look at you. The trousers like you're wearing is jumper. I'm, I'm handsome, but I've always been handsome. Man, that feels good. That feels good to know that if I bang a girl, that's fine. That our, ch our children will be so fine. Thank God, though. Now, God. At least not plus one. Not plus one, con. She go, when, the, when the girl I'm, I'm going to marry, when I ask her out, and she's calculating pros and cons, pro will be, one of the pros will be jeans. I have good jeans. I, I pray to God. Amen. You know, now I'm trying to get the money, so I'll have I'll have good jeans. I'm talking Giorgio. Is it Giorgio Armani or is it Giorgio? Hey, I don't expose myself. Oh, say I know no designer. Oh, is it Giorgio or Jojo or is it JJ? The JJ I know is our culture, so I don't know Giorgio Armani. Eh? I support my own. Like I wear Mac Payne. What I'm wearing right now is Mackie's fashion. This is my own. I don't know Giorgio Armani. I don't know Mike. 
even though I know Mike. <laughs> Nike. Oh, guys, thank you so much. I'm going to freestyle in a bit. And then it's it. We rap for the day. And I come back again and show you the way. My name is Ray. You know, flow day. It's easy. It's coming straight from the brain. I know they even think I'm again. It just they flow through my vein. Be like blood. Be like what? It's for sure. No, be like I they play what? I go market. I buy many things. But now my people own and they buy. I they support my girl own. I they support my guy. If I post famous person, I go still post my guy. Do you understand? No, they do like that if you know they post your own person. Eh? Huh? They vex me when you know they post your own person. Why you know they post your own person? You're messing down. Your nothing about you is up. What's up? Eh? You they vex. Why everything is up? Eh? Support your own. Pull your own people up. Eh? What's in the video say? We rise by lifting others. That's what's up. Eh? Don't they do anyhow. If you do any you say anyhow. Take a bow, Ray, because you be spitting them rhymes. <laughs> hey, guys, it's a wrap, and I love every single one that's watching, that's in this room, and I love myself, and we all love God. So thank you very much. Thank you very much, man. We really appreciate it. Hey. Ray's on each chat, baby. Oh.